everybody, welcome to another Buddy Reviews. Today we're checking out a neat product that I have actually been wanting to get my hands on for a long time now. This is a Mystery Ranch bottle pouch. You see the tag right here. Contract number NSN. Manufacture date was 2015 in October. It's a SOCOM Nalgene bottle pocket multicam. Yeah, multicam. Nomenclature's water bottle pouch multicam. And it says LR. I don't know if that means large. I'm assuming it does. Uh, cool ass pouch. I actually got this. By pure chance, I was at D14. I saw a dude, pretty cool kit. We started talking. I was like, hey, nice kit. And I noticed the pouch. I said, oh, very cool Mystery Ranch water bottle pouch. And he said, I don't really like it. And I was like, would you sell it? And he said, sure. And literally took it right off his rig and sold it to me right then and there. So thank you very much, dude. I appreciate you. If you see this video, you know who you are. The pouch itself has a Big grommet at the bottom for draining, which is great because it's meant to hold water bottles. If it breaks, it will drain out. You're not going to collect and pull up a bunch of water in here. You have an elasticized lip that is kind of bunched up to help kind of keep it tight. And you have a nice little ring here for holding other two. I don't know what you'd use that for personally. Maybe putting a clip through here to hold like a bottled lid or something. I don't know. The back is stiffened which I actually liked a lot. There's a stiffener in here. Feels like maybe Tigris or some sort of thermoplastic, but it is a stiffener of some type. Rear is three rows of pals. It is the Jacquard woven Murdoch webbing. I love this stuff. I think it's just so much better than Solution Dyed. You've heard me say that in so many reviews if you've been watching my channel over the, over the years, how much I absolutely love this woven Jacquard webbing. And then... The, the molly straps are the same woven jacquard Balticam webbing with some thermoplastic tuck, tuck tabs. And then you bring it through, you'll tuck it back here out of this bottom row right there. That's why they're together. It is two rows wide, so it's a pretty small footprint. So you can put it on a lot of stuff and utilize it. What will this hold? Well, it is said to be a Nalgene bottle pouch, so it will hold a Nalgene bottle. But it'll also hold this Fierce Grape Gatorade very well. I actually didn't want to come out. I mean, that's pretty cool. So that elasticized lip just kind of hugs this bottle and it stays where it needs to be. So a small bottle will fit in here just fine. This is a 20 fluid ounce bottle of Fierce Grape Gatorade. What else will it hold? Here's an analog for an algae. This is something I haven't reviewed yet. Frog Tog Chili Pad. Pretty good size. It'll fit in there just fine. This is... About 10 inches high and about three inches wide. So that gives you an idea of what else will fit in here. I got another bottle to try. We got my big old mama jammer right here. This is my tried and true Hydro Flask 40 ounce. This big old guy right here. And it will fit in here too. A little high, but it will fit. I wouldn't regularly recommend going this big, but it will work in a pinch. So, hide your flask, this pouch. Small water bottles will fit in here too with no problem, and then pretty much everything in between. What will it, where would it fit? What will it fit on? Well, side of a pack really well. That would be a nice place for it. Anywhere where you have two inches wide of molly space, a belt line would be nice. I run a Arbor Arms on a belt already. Similar concept to this, a little different, and I really like it. I'm actually going to have my son run this here coming up in September. But another place this thing goes really well on, it's right here. So this is a Ferro Concepts chest rig. have not reviewed this yet, but I will be. And this pouch is kind of fantastic for here because you just molly it on. I'm not going to go full bore here. Just kind of, kind of put it through so you can just get an idea of what it would be like. So if you had it actually mollied on, it hangs down about an, an inch-ish from the rig. But it'd be great because now you could have water, radio, bags, boom. This is now a very simple reconnaissance type thing slash fob, fob kit, bump in the night, whatever you want to call it, where you can just grab it, go, you could have some magazines, water, radio, boom, you're done. Very simplistic. 
fantastic piece of kit to add to this. I'm really, I really like it. I think it's really cool. I really hope I can track a few more of these down. I haven't seen them very much since uh, I first saw them out back in the day, and I thought they were really cool, and I just never got one. I always wanted one, so I jumped on the chance to grab this single one right here. Great little pouch. If you're looking for a Molly water bottle pouch that will hold a pretty decent uh, array of bottles, and you get a chance to grab one of these, I highly recommend it, and no matter what color you can get in. I was really lucky it was in multicam. But I would have jumped on this if it was Ranger Green or Coyote Brown. Anyway, that's all I got, guys. I hope you got something out of this review of the Mystery Ranch bottle pouch, the SOCOM bottle pouch. Again, I, to my knowledge, these are not plentiful and easy to come by, but they are super cool pouches. Anyway, as always, guys, man, get out there, play some airsoft, be a bunch of nerds, warp smarter, not harder, and remember... Always make sure you have a source of hydration on you, because if you do not hydrate, you will die. Peace.